Damo, yes. how good was that? It was nice, yeah, 67, uh, played alongside uh, Marilyn there, and she, she had 65, so uh, still couldn't win the group, but I, I'm really pleased with six. And I didn't know what was going to happen today. I haven't played a tournament since Scottish Open in August, so it was nice for me to get out and get a really good number. Do you, do you ever think about you know how you used to grind away or whenever when it comes to a, a bit of a gap in your schedule like that? Well, yeah, yeah. It's, um, I've never had that long off in my life. My mum wasn't very well and I, I just stayed at home with her and just kept entering tournaments but had to withdraw, withdraw because she wasn't getting any better and it just worked out that I had six months off and, and then now turn up here not knowing what I'm doing. I mean, I've been on tour 35 years and I didn't have a clue what to do. So it was a bit weird but a good result. And you love this tournament, I know that. Oh yeah, it's one of my favorite. Well, it might even be my favourite tournament. We play on two great courses, and we get to play alongside the guys, which is always nice for us. And uh, and the galleries come out and watch us, so you can't really beat it. As long as the weather stays like this, which I don't think it's going to. The weekend's going to be mean, but other than that, it's a good week. You had a, um, a first-time caddy on your bag today, Rebecca Artis, former LPGA Tour player. How did she go? Do you know what? It's the best I've putted in 20 years. I don't know how many putts I have, but it's the fewest I've had. So uh, it was uh, really nice to have someone on the greens that she's a really good green ready. She does that aim point, which bamboozles me. I haven't got a clue what she's up to, but she got the lines right. So I, if I keep stroking it like that and she keeps reading them like that, you know, we might have a chance making the cut and make the weekend and see what happens, which when I got here, I wasn't too sure about. And you're, you're, if you do that, you're a revered, renowned winner. Did you ever let that sort of sink back into your mind? No, I mean, to, to come here and think of winning, no. no I, I mean, for me, if I make the cut, uh, certainly the first cut and, and the second cut would be a huge bonus after six months not playing tournament golf. Mm. So, um, no, the thoughts of winning hadn't entered my head. Sometimes when you don't think about things, they, they happen. But, no, I'm, I'm a long way from winning, I can assure you that. But, you, I mean, you've had wins. I mean, it hasn't been on the LPGA Tour, but you've won the Senior Women's Open and, you know, that sort of tournament, you can't... It's still in there. Oh no, absolutely! Don't get me wrong. Further down the line, you know, three, two, three months time, if I've been, if I've played solid schedule, which I'm going to do, I'm going to play a really big schedule this year. Then who knows if I'm playing well? But at the moment, I'm just trying to find my feet again, which, like I said, it's weird after 35 years. Well played. I'm sure you made a lot of people happy out there today. Oh, thanks very much.